Residents battling an industrial estate at Narangba, north of Brisbane, which they say is ruining their health, have won a small victory. After a meeting with the Premier, the suburb's air will be tested for chemicals and there'll be a rethink about what businesses should be there. Led by longtime campaigner Fran Gell, this was a day of reckoning for Narangba residents. There's a lot of people got a lot to answer for. They met with the Premier and other senior government ministers and bureaucrats to discuss the Narangba industrial estate. Calls for its closure were rejected. Instead, a long-term plan was agreed on, including fortnightly meetings. In an hour and a half today, we have got some outcomes. That has to be good for the community. Tomorrow, the government will release chemical results taken on the night of last August's huge chemical fire. Another scientific study will assess the impact of those chemicals and residents and doctors will be interviewed about related health issues. As a second tier, the estate's total amount of emissions, odours and noise will be examined. The results released next April. Look at any cumulative effect of the activities of the site to ensure that the community is satisfied with the long-term use of the site. The government will also review the businesses that are here to determine whether they're appropriate. Up to four have already been earmarked for relocation. I did want some real action today, but I am happy on the compromise. By April next year, we will have a final decision on that estate. A class action against the government is still expected to be filed in coming weeks. Melissa Downs, National 9 News.